The Juneteenth observance is tomorrow. Now it commemorates an event which dates back to June 19th, 1865 and commemorates the end of slavery. The Tubman Museum is unveiling a new Juneteenth exhibit. Simone Soublé went to check it out. The Tubman Museum here in Macon is celebrating Juneteenth with some new and interactive exhibits. These exhibits are set to tell new and different stories about the history of African Americans in middle Georgia, from slavery to the civil rights movement to now. Holidays like this focus people's attention and minds on celebrating black history and black culture. The exhibit Untold Stories, Macon's African American History, has been renovated to tell the story of African Americans here in middle Georgia. Local history is on display for thousands of visitors to embrace their past, and people are already taking a look. Museum curator Jeffrey Bruce says Juneteenth is a time to learn and celebrate. There are lots of stories about individuals and organizations and institutions here in town and how they made that transition or helped us as a community make that transition from slavery uh, to freedom through Jim Crow. Uh, all the way through civil rights. And one of those stories is Dr. Valerie Montgomery Rice. I think about Juneteenth as an opportunity to think about where we've been, but more importantly, where we are going. Rice grew up in Macon, graduated from Southwest High School in 1979, earned her engineering degree from Georgia Tech and medical degree from Harvard. She finished her residency in obstetrics and gynecology at Emory University School of Medicine. Now she's the president and CEO of Morehouse School of Medicine. Her white coat and other memorabilia are on display in the Tubman Museum, and she says she's happy to be a part of the history. I am learning about myself as others are learning about me because clearly if you continue to be open and receptive and listen to learn, you will always learn from others. In Macon, Simone Soublé, 13 WMAZ News. And Judge William C. Randall, another Macon native, also has historic articles on display in the Tubman. Now there's a preview reception that's going on right now. It runs till 8. Free for Tubman members, $5 for general admission, and a full day of events at the Tubman tomorrow, all free.